What's up, Volans? I'm getting ready to start here soon. I was just playing around with some features today. Working on getting stream elements all set up. But we'll be starting in just a moment. I'm doing great. It's been a, a great day. Very productive. I've spent most of it sorting magic cards, but uh, it feels nice to get something done and accomplished for once. How, how are you doing today? That's good. All right is a good baseline. I mean, the world is in disarray right now, so all right, it feels like a great place to be in, honestly. <laughs> all right. Let's let's hop into this. Let's see let's see how this transition goes. Boom. Are we there? Are we live? Heck yeah. All right. <laughs> That's like 90% of life, so I, I think you're doing great. Uh, what what features do we have today? Oh, we can do bug support to badgetown.com. That's really good to know. And we can get rid of our ooblets finally. Yes! We've also got a billion bug fixes we've added over the course of last week and half. Okay. Once we get the major bugs done, we can start working on more content. Let's do it. All right, let's get rid of some of these these ooblets we have. We have way too many. Uh, what guys can we get rid of now that we finally can? We have one, two, three, four. We have four lump stumps we can we can go send out into the wild. Uh, it's not an update. I just found out that there's an experimental build in your epics folder, so. You can play the the beta of the beta, basically. A hankerin for reet root. We don't have any reet root zuff zuffles. I'm sorry. Unfortunately, reet root has not been grown. Uh, let's see if we can find this. Supposedly, was it at our farm? I think it was at our farm. There should be an area where we can release them into the wild now. Maybe it's not here. Oh, we need to do some management of all this. It's getting a little cluttered over here. Oh, and we have some we have some herbs to pick here. All right. Get this spark flower. And then we can deal with these guys too while we're at it. I think we're going to be spending a lot of time the next couple of days just farming away. We have a lot of a lot of dead stuff just floating around. What do you have, Taffy? Hop crops buns, hop crops bun. One a toodly, two a toodly, hop crops bun. Couldn't have said it better myself. Instead of trying to fix up all the world's problems, I just try to fix my balloon. You know, if everyone had something as singular to focus on as that, I think the world might be a great place. Aha, I think this is it. This is where we set them free. What do you have to say? Something really weird happened in the wildlands. The whole town heard a really loud noise, but by the time we got here, there was nothing to see. Nobody's really sure what happened, but whatever it was sure freaked out the local ooblets. Most of them ran off, and the ones that stuck around became really skittish. Aw, poor ooblets. They're being terrorized. Hmm. Why? Oh. Oh, okay, we're repopulating the wildlands. Okay, I thought we were just releasing them into terror to die. That would not have been very good. We won't be able to go in there after them for a while. Yeah. All right, cool. And Uba's a lot safer than in the real world. Never, ever abandon real pets in the wilderness. <laughs> a 
Oh my god. What a disclaimer. Wow. I I'm like glad they made that connection, but also I'm a little kind of terrified that they felt the need to. I I guess we do learn real world skills from games, but to think that we could just drop off our animals in the wilderness. That's insane. Okay, so we can only drop off the ones following us. We we have so many of these these strum lump dudes. We we got to get rid of some of them. They're just taking up our space. We want to we want to get the cuties, like these little caterpillars. And we can't do that if we have too many of one kind, unfortunately. I I wish I wish I could keep them all. I really do. But it's just so expensive to get more ooblet inventory. So instead, we ship them off into the darkness and hope that they'll live a better life. All right, we're going to send like all these guys home. Uh, and we're going to get these lump stumps to follow us. Come on, lump stumps. Join. Join the follow babies so I can send you to your freedom. You're going to go to a nice farm uptown. It's okay. Don't worry. Nothing can hurt you there. We have one more lump stump somewhere. Where are you hiding, sweetie? You, you, friend. Join the follow babies. All right. You have all been a wonderful addition to the team. Your efforts and love will be missed. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Who needs... You can't do... Wait, hold on. Oh, I clicked on the wrong thing. This is what we want. <laughs> who who needs the expensive and space taking childcare? Uh, we can just send them off to live a life of luxury and peace out in the sweet sweet wilderness, roaming the land with the coyotes. Lump stump deposited into the wildlands. Yes, we have more. We have another lump stump to go into the wildlands. And another lump stump, for we accidentally farmed way too many. Yes. I, I feel like eventually I should get an achievement for abandoning enough children, but I feel like that also might encourage some pretty despicable play patterns. So, all right, we've done it. We've deposited all of our ooblets that we need to. Now we can have some nice diversity on our team instead of just 12 lump stumps oh we can have we caught one of these yet i don't think we've caught the variant uh or even one of them to begin with okay well let's catch this guy while we can oh we need five ooblets all right we wouldn't want to do this with half a team so we have we have four open slots. We've got to bring Peter Porker with us, right? We can't leave Peter Porker behind. Where are you at, Peter Porker? There you are. Also, if you have any great names for these sweet ooblet babies, let me know because I I could definitely use some more. We have the only one we have named so far is Peter Porker, so any any more names we can come up with that are fun. We can also farm these dumb birds now. It's a dumb bird. I feel like that one's a hard one to rename because dumb bird is just so good already. Like what, how do you top that? Do we name it smart bird? Just like in a bit of like irony? I don't know. They don't feel like smart birds to me. They feel like dumb birds. Dumb bird feels perfect. Uh, unless we named it just like Danny DeVito's penguin or something. Because that's kind of a dumb bird too, right? Danny DeVito as the penguin. All right. Now we can battle. One, two, three, four, five. Boom. Dun, 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 dun. All right. Uh, we can play our next move twice and gain four points. It's not great, but... We don't have a lot of other options right now. 
I think we can run out this whole hand, actually. And we'll get a stun on probably one of the radishes so they don't start charging an insta win. That would kind of suck. I think we're going to we're going to be a little slow on this one and then take our free point. All right. I do really like these radish guys. They're so that like they stand out in such stark contrast to everything around them because they're just so tall and gangly. Uh, steal 16 points after four turns of warm up. That's not bad. We have two. Well, we want the hype for sure, and we want to give them the fluster. And then from there, we either steal some points in a few turns or just go for the win now. I think we're gonna. Hmm, we're going to go for the steal the points. I feel like this is going to be a long game. We're not getting a lot of hype or anything, so. And they're counter-stealing us a lot. So it's going to be a lot of back and forth. A little more fluster will help us, certainly. All right. Speaking of a little more fluster. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun. Man, these ooblets have, like, ten times more rhythm than I do. And it makes me a little bit jealous. I, I wish I could dance like this, and all they're doing is just kind of happily shuffling to the left and right. But I don't got that. I don't have any rhythm. I, I've i tried so hard to learn to dance, but I'm a leader. I'm, I'm a follower, not a leader, so. And even then, I'm a very bad follower. All right. Boom. I think we got this in the bag. We're about to steal all their points. It won't quite be 16, but it'll be enough to kind of cripple them. All your moves cost one beat this turn. Actually, it might be enough to get us there now. Because that's going to be 18. Oh, we're one point shy. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to steal all of their points, and it's going to win us if we only needed one point. <laughs> all right. I want one of these loot scoots. They just give you free items, which is so cool. I, I don't think we've ran into any yet, though, and I don't even know where we'd find them at. <laughs> you know, it's 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 true. I only have enough dancing in my life for oomlets, honestly. No one can compete with it. No one can compete with the warmth these oomlets provide in my heart. Yo, what's up, Sir Milk Dud? How you doing? We just won our first battle of the night and got a variant, which is amazing. We're on fire already. I, I'm feeling it. Tonight's the night we find a gleamy. If they're even in game yet, I I have no evidence to support that they're in game yet, but we're hoping to find a gleamy today, and we're gonna plant some of these sweet oublets and a lot of seeds. We have so many seeds to plant. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, as we as we waste all our energy tilling away. <laughs> uh, it's. Uh, Gleamies are like the shinies of the game. It, the shinies of Pokemon in this game. They're they're apparently a super rare variant that can farm you rare items. Uh, and I am doing well. The stream is going great so far. I, I'm feeling really good about today. We've got plenty of farming to do. We've got plenty of battles. And we got plenty of time. If we don't have some awesome... Yeah, it's it's a very cool game. It's like the best of Pokemon meets Stardew Valley meets uh, Slay the Spire, kind of, in, in the sense that the game is very... Uh, it's, it's card-based for the battles, which is super dope. Hell yeah! We we are at it. We're, we're going for affiliate. Hopefully we can get it soonish, but... We're in no rush. We're just here to have some fun, honestly. But I, I do appreciate you tuning in for that. It's super, super cool of you. I love everything about the community that, that's growing, and I, I want to be a part of it as much as I can. 
Alright, do you have your own channel? Uh, Vol Volans is getting ready to start up streaming here soon. Once once they get a new place. Which I am super excited for. I can't wait to check out your Ooblet stream. Oh, you're starting up next week? Hell yeah. Nice. Uh, Battlefield 2? Battlefront 2? Uh, <laughs> BF is such a, such a rough acronym. I never know which one it stands for exactly. I'm assuming Battlefront. That one's more relevant. <laughs> it's super charming, honestly. And it's... It's got this very great, depressing, uh, like, millennial humor, which is just amazing. One of the characters is constantly making reference to the bodies buried underneath your farm, which is super sketchy, but we love it. <laughs> you know, my first day streaming Volans, I didn't even realize I streamed a black screen for four and a half hours. So, it, it can't get... Th much worse than that, honestly. I, I have a lot of fate in you. I'm sure it will go swimmingly, honestly. <laughs> oh, I think it's hilarious. I <laughs> I I love a good uh, dark irony, and and I think there's something so charming about being very gung ho to start something up. Uh, yeah, I had no viewers my first day, and I'm assuming that's probably why, but. I couldn't tell you because no one commented on it at all the whole time, so. My average viewer count since then has been roughly two or three, so. <laughs> Who'd have thought that people want to actually turn tune into gameplay? Uh, I just started last week. I've been trying to do it on and off for like a year, but I never really dedicated an actual schedule to it. So I sat down uh, oh, last weekend and just blocked out the time so I could actually start taking it seriously. So I've been doing it for a full week now, which has been nice. It's a week more than I can say I've ever streamed in my life consistently. So you got to start somewhere. <laughs> a week will turn into a month will turn into a year eventually, right? That's how time works, I think, linearly. What do you have to say, Mead? Uh, ooh, let's sell, let's sell some sweet beauties. We don't need all of these. We'll get rid of half of them. Get us a little bit of income here. No, we don't want to trade. We want to talk. What darkness do you have for us? Some people around here have impressive gardens, but we don't get many full-on farmers like you. Aw. Thanks, Mead. Thanks. I just set up the overlay... Uh, today for so this is my first time streaming with the overlay and I wasn't sure how it would turn out <laughs> the camera has been on and off I'm not sure about the lighting yet I think I need to work on it a little bit but I'm just using uh, Logitech C90 at the moment so thanks guys I'm glad the quality looks good I have a lot of tech laying around from other stuff I do so, it's been nice to repurpose it for something like this, too. Oh, the super tactical, cool, free thinking dudes. I love it. It's very wordy. But who needs short and concise to describe a friendship? All friendships are described that way. Alright. Let's go check out our dance barn. We haven't done the dance tournament today yet, have we? Do we have the energy to do it? Awesome. Thank you. I'm I'm glad. I only have one front light right now, so it does worry me, but if it looks good, that's what matters. Okay, it doesn't look like we have the energy to do our dance battle. Let's go take a nap real quick. Uh Thanks. The the <laughs> the the mic is uh, sure SM7B, so I'm really glad that that sounds good. I use it for podcasting, so it definitely serves both functions very well. Currently, I stream on Monday nights. I'm just kind of streaming whatever. It's Ooblets right now, 
uh, on Tuesdays and Fridays, I stream games from the Humble Bundles for uh, another project I work on. It's for a podcast. And then Wednesdays, I'm doing competitive games. So this week we're going to do, uh, what is it, Rogue Company? I just found out about it like a day ago, and I'm super stoked to try it out. And then Thursdays, I do some weird uh, avant-garde stuff. <laughs> it's the best way I can think to describe it. This Thursday, uh, we're probably going to be playing all three Dark Souls games at the same time. Which is going to be a wild ride. I don't know how successful that's going to be. <laughs> I, I would probably have better luck if I... I just stuck to one game but i i have a hard time with that level of commitment in my life it feels like a lot it's dawning the idea of just doing one thing every day Ooh, scofalo uh what kind of battle is this actually we need to make sure we know that so we don't accidentally all moves cost zero beats okay um who has expensive moves it's got to be... We got to go with Lump Stump. He's so good. I think he's probably the most broken character right now. I need to get back into Stardew Valley. It's been a real hot minute since I've played it. But I love that game so much. I went back to my farm not too long ago and was just overwhelmed with how much I had actually accomplished in that game and totally forgotten. So, I need to start a new one. I never finished Hollow Knights either. Oh my gosh! They just schooled us! I don't think we're gonna beat them! That was so fast! 16 points in one turn? We can't compete with that! We got a measly four. That's totally fair. That's a whole other investment to start doing, like, console games and stuff. I wish that, like, Nintendo... Okay, Ugh, man, I don't think so. I think they're going to get this. Seven points. Yep. They just need one more. Dang. That was intense. I was not expecting them to cruise through that so quickly. Okay. I jump between consoles and PC a lot, but I prefer PC just because it's easier than, like, dealing with extra equipment and stuff. I am on OBS. I was using Streamlabs for a while, but it just doesn't quite have the functionality to do some of the the weirder things I'm looking to do. So I went back to OBS and then uh, installed Stream Elements onto it. Which has been super helpful. I just found out about Stream Elements like a day ago, but I am in love with it already. I think... Let's see. I'm going to test out and see... Let's see if this works. Yeah, there we go. I just set up shoutouts too. So go check out Sir Milk Dud's Battlefront server too. <laughs> I was uh, watching my buddy stream the other day and they were setting up all of this live, so it was super helpful getting that like first hand witnessing of how to do it all it was it was very enlightening Ooh, we have some oblets we can shove in this grinder let's get them scanned boom i think we have one two three of them right now <laughs> it really is i i could not figure out really how to do it well on labs i kind of gave up doing any sort of overlays or anything on labs 
So I'm really glad I downloaded uh, Stream Elements because theirs is a lot easier to work with. Boom. Ooh, a new badge for scanning our boys. Let's find out. Where are you at, you cute little fish? Yeah. I really should have just come, had you come pick these up instead of sending them out. Yeah, you should have. Yeah, it's it's really nice. You can just link like a browser link. And so there's there's websites that'll set it up based on like URLs. That, or at least that's how they did it with stream elements. I don't know if yours is set up the same way. Uh, Honestly, I, I can't say I have any real short-term, long-term goals. I mean, hitting affiliates going to be cool. That's definitely a goal. Uh, partner eventually. Like those are like the obvious goals. But beyond that, I just kind of want to have fun and, and build a community, you know? I'm, I'm more interested in bringing some entertainment to some folks than I am, like, actually succeeding in any sort of sense, you know? Ah, oh, yes! Lump Stump variant. I'd rather make, like, one or two people really happy and, and have fun than, you know, build an empire or anything. <laughs> But yeah, definitely affiliate and partner would be really cool to hit just just for the the uh, the street cred, you know. Uh, we can't steal any points, so let's gain a hype. Dun, dun, dun. And then three points ain't gonna do us much good, so let's lower all our warm ups. What are your goals in the end? Okay, two points. Oh gosh, we're fighting a bunch of lump stumps. They're just gonna be gaining hype galore. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll steal and fluster him. I think that's a great way to start. <laughs> Discard a random card. Nah. Get ahead of him now. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> you know. It is Attack of the Lump Stumps. I, ooh, three points and two hype, or all our moves. Oh, we want to do both of these, actually. We'll gain a beat first. If I saw an army of Lump Stumps like this coming at me in real life, I would just give up. Oh, really? Hell yeah. That's super, I mean, that's way cooler than streaming, honestly. A pro soccer player in Austria? That's awesome. What? I mean, <laughs> I'm like flabbergasted at that. That's so cool. How long have you been playing soccer? What, what got you to that level? And that's, that's the way to do it, right? Just kind of have fun with it. And that's what I'm treating it more of is like a, a nice side hobby than anything too real. If I can do something I'd already be doing at home, but like hang out with people while I'm doing it, I think that's way more fun. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I love that so much. Uh, I don't know a lot about of soccer, but I... I've never really been a sports person myself, but what position do you play? I know there's positions, right? We will take that sweet lump stump seed. Gimme, gimme, gimme. They are, uh, like... I, I'm trying to think of the best way I can describe this in my my layman's terms, but like, you're that means you're the position that like actually goes for goals, right? Yeah, perfect. That's what I thought. That's awesome. So you get all the cred too. <laughs> Is it? I, I don't know how much it works. Like, is it your favorite position to play too, or is it just 
does it just so happen to be the position you're best at? I don't know if there's that kind of distinction at all. <laughs> Which is nice. I mean, obviously, like, the team is all working together, but to be able to just, like, come in and finish it. <laughs> I absolutely bet. I can't. Um, I, me too. Me too, Volness. I tried several years to get into several different sports. The best one I was ever at was like wrestling, kind of. Even then, it was a stretch. But, oh, wow. Why is everyone? Oh, I'm up late. Oh, we're going to be exhausted tomorrow. That's okay. Apparently, everyone refreshes their dialogue, though, at at midnight up late time. But yeah, I, I can imagine that nothing compares to that feeling. Like, it, it has to be... Whoa, did that weed just give us seeds? Neat. <laughs> yeah, my sport is like napping and eating burritos. That's what I go with. Anything more than that is just exhausting. I have nothing but, like, admiration for people who can play sports, though. It's it's so cool. So you had, you had an internship for soccer, and you, and you couldn't go there physically? How does that work out? Like, how, how do you do that virtually? Or, or is the internship and the training a separate thing? Oh, I know you are. I don't have any for you, though. Uh, long lobs. We don't have any of those either. All right. What we do have, however, is some stuff to sell. We got to clear out our pockets a bit. We're running on peak full. Mead will take all our garbage for us. Won't you, Mead? Hmm. Oh, what do we have? Hop dops, pompadoms, lop of flowers. Those are what we need. All right. Yo, thank you so much, Vol Volans TV. I appreciate it so much. How How is everyone doing tonight? You have an internship for a pro soccer team. Okay. So what kind of what kind of training or what kind of projects do you do for a soccer team like that? That's that seems I, I'm not sure like what kind of realm of of work you can do outside of I mean, this is just my ignorance speaking because I don't know much about the industry or anything. It just seems I mean, I guess there's like marketing and stuff, but what what level of work do you do? Like, what kind of jobs do they have you do? All right. Uh, let's go drop our Crunchster. I don't know why we're still carrying that with us, too. We have no need for that at all. Dun, dun, dun. All right. We're going to go put this over here by our little, our little Chiba hut. Oh, are we tired already? No, we just are stuck. Okay. <laughs> and let's stick a couple folks in here so they can start watering this area. Uh, oh, we'll have two Quampers work it. They'll work the farm for us for now. Dun, dun, dun. And then we can drop off some more seeds here because they'll water them for us. Okay. What else do we have? We have some more cloth plant. Oh, there's an oublet doing something there. And there. All right. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Uh, we can drop one more here, it looks like. I think that's all. Nope, we have a ton of sweet BD seeds, too. 
We are just rolling in seeds right now. Okay. That's all we can really do right now. Now we'll drop this Crunchster. Right here. Oh, it won't let us. Oh, we can rotate it. Perfect. Hmm. What's your problem? Do both those need to be cleared? Aha! Got it. You just finished work on how the organize, organization should shift their practices during COVID. Oh, okay. That's super cool. So you're you're providing sort of like a a, a consultation on like how how they can like bre best implement safety features or safety guidelines and stuff too right now. That's super cool. I I didn't think. I, I don't know why I, I just it's a very like Western thought that like sports people just do sports stuff, which is a very Western, very bad thought. Probably I, I never thought of that sort of level of integration inside the company with the players as well, which is super cool. All right. Fiddle bricks. Some doodad in my balloon just broke, and it may or may not have been integral. Oh, nice. <laughs> uh, yes, I've got tons of planks for you, Gimbal. Please take them off my hand. I think I have 203. Uh, the rectangular thing on my screen to the left. I think that's supposed to be displaying chat. I'm like 60% sure that's what that's supposed to be doing. Uh, but it does not look like it's actually doing that. Thank you for pointing that out. Uh, I'm going to have to take a look at that. Okay. Do you know what would the NBA be in exactly? I, I've been debating moving into a master's study, but the idea of it is just so daunting after having just finished. Ooh, we have not gone into this clubhouse yet. How long has this been open for us? Schooling after schooling just feels exhausting. Welcome. I couldn't have put this all together without you. Aw, thanks. What can we buy from you? Is that is that a just a coffee mug? It's probably a drink, right? Yeah, a malt. Okay. They do have some seeds we can buy. A band-aid, a backpacky, and a beanie. Oh, we can get a little beanie for our for our guys. We might have to spend some time doing some fashion shopping soon. What mission do you have? Six clothlets. Oof. We need those for something else right now, don't we? No? Okay, cool. But we only have two. We'll bring back some. Gotcha. Okay. That's super cool. I, I really love that. That's, I, hell yeah, chase that. You can do a lot with that. I mean, <laughs> would you want to get into managing a uh, sports team specifically, or are there other sort of like industries that you'd want to get into? <laughs> oh, the fashion police can come. We, we will destroy the fashion police. We have fashion for days. In fact, what do, what do we have right now? Let's mix it up. The onesie with styles a good look. We could rep the onesie and the and the very lovely hat. Oh, now we look too much like me. Maybe uh oh, I I do like the the onesie though. Let's go with that and the and that hat there. Mix it up a little bit. Okay. That's awesome. Those are those are such good industries to get into. I I love charity and nonprofit work so much i i wish we had better means of like making it more efficient and more uh not not affordable but like you know you know what i'm trying to say i hope like realistic like not uh, sustainable there's the word i'm looking for sustainable 
it, it always feels like nonprofits and charities are are walking a fine line. But I, I do very much love the work that they're all doing. All right. We'll earn four points. Da, 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 da. Let's hope we can actually get a win on these dance battles today. Get two extra beats after one term of warm-up. Okay. We can just gain a beat now. We don't need to wait turns. Oh, if we get a stun off, that's just going to cripple him, I think. So let's just go ahead and do that now. Oop, as I just run through one of the turns. That was a, that was a big old misplay there. But we'll do it. We got this. This one's in the bag. Gain five points. Exactly. I. It, it, it's such a, a fine balance of like how how much do we give people to do good versus like how much do we just like live with it not happening and and I think we really need more emphasis on the sort of like altruistic businesses that are actually making a difference we have a lot of businesses out there that aren't doing much for anyone except like shareholders which really sucks all right we've won our first dance competition going into game two Are there any specific nonprofits that that you really like the out there right now that are doing good work, or are are you more interested in seeing what develops by the time that you've you've finished school and everything? Tamlins, oh look at these guys! Oh, they look like Dinky Simpson characters. All right, Tamlin, we're going for it. Uh, let's go with these two. We're going to get a stun off so we don't have to see what these guys are going to do yet. Dun, dun. I think we might have gotten more points if we'd gone with the other two moves. But that's okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, all moves cost one beat. They already do, so that's not a big deal. Let's start with this. Gain another beat. I I haven't got to do any like a lot with Boys and Girls Club or Red Cross. I I vaguely remember some Boys and Girls Club stuff from my childhood. I know a lot of their 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 organization was focused on like uh, at least in my area after school stuff and and sort of providing an area for children to learn beyond just the classroom and, and to have like safe spaces when they couldn't go home and stuff. But I, I don't know what exactly that extends to like their mission statement or what they're, they're doing in other parts of the world or anything. And yeah, Red Cross is always, they, <laughs> they're, they're like the epitome of, of wholesome organizations. <laughs> I, I wish, <laughs> I, oh man, I need to, you, you've got me thinking about how little I actually donate blood, and I don't even know my blood type. I should probably get out there and donate at some point. I just have not had the time or chance. It's true though, like, man, he, he, hedge fund managers and, and big business, they get, they get way more support than the actual people who are, who are trying to help everyone <laughs> it'd be nice if there was a shift in focus but i don't know if that's going to come anytime soon which is kind of sad but i guess it's, it's people like you that actually go out there and, and push for it and make a difference and i think that's what's going to cause that shift and change in the world 
the more people who are actually on board with these messages and actually fighting for it, the, the more the world will change. Dun, 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 dun. We're getting wishy left and right right now. We should take a look at how much we got right now. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, did we get a propeller hat? Oh, that's so cute. We have to put that on Dumbbird, right? Moogie. <laughs> is this just like a dude with horns? This is just... It's a Sasquatch. It's like a baby Sasquatch. I, I feel wrong fighting it. Oh, we, we're carrying two of these guys with us right now. We should drop one of those off at our home and get... We'll bring the colored variant and then leave the other. Uh, all right. All moves cost one beat. And then we can add some trepidation and earn seven points. Dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. I feel like there's a ton of ooblets we haven't even seen or encountered yet. I don't know if they're just going to be in other zones or if we have to just keep unlocking more ooblets. All right, we have five total points. Uh, so that's either one of these. I think we got to go for the points right now. And let's stun this little egg. This little egg bird. It just came out about two weeks ago. I believe it's it's not terribly old and it's still in early access right now. It's only on the Epic Game Store at the moment. So, it's it's very new. Dun, 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 dun. That's got to be a struggle not liking needles and giving blood all the time. How do you how do you cope? Like what mechanisms do you use to deal with that? Or is it just kind of like bite the bullet and do it? Gain one point. They always sequence this so weird. I, I feel like the AI could be a little smarter in this game. But, uh, so we can gain seven points or three points in a hype. I think we just want the seven points right now. Alright. Three trepidation. Uh, I think we just keep going points, right? We're on that grind. We should get there in a second. We only need three more. Oh, perfect. We've done it. We've won a dance battle today. Yes! Even with the sloppy misplays. Look at that lump stump twerking. You get it, guys. Alright, we have to... Okay, that's good. I, I'm glad you've had, like, good nurses while you do it. I'm sure that helps a ton. Has it... Has doing it so frequently helped you with the fear at all? Or is it just kind of, like, staying the same throughout it? <laughs> yes, he is. Lumstump can get it. Oh, we have a... We have a lot to do. All right. Uh, where is this cute... This cute propeller hat? We are so putting that on Dumbbird. Look at him. Now he's trying to fly twice as hard. But you can't. You're just a dumb bird. That's That really sucks. I wish there were, were ways to get over that kind of stuff. But I, I've never struggled much with phobias in my own life. But it, it, it sucks. And, and I mean, at least you're, you're fighting through it and, and still donating. That's mad respect to you. I, I don't know if I would be able to, to fight through it. Okay, a uh, bigger tool belt might not be bad. I've just been blindly spending my wishies. I, I probably should have put a little more thought into that. But I got really eager. What do we have? More energy might not be a bad one right now. I'm not too worried about the expansions. Yeah, I think I think we want more energy while we have the the wishies to do it. Dun, dun. 
All right. I suppose you're here to try to sell me magazines. It's going great, my guy. How is your night going? We are we are at it with some oobleds. We just won our first dance battle today, or our first dance competition. Uh, why is there never why is why is there never cake around, Melda? Like seriously, I could go for some cake right now, and there's none around. Ugh. The plights of life. It's just tragic. We need better access to cake. Uh, we did get. <laughs> it is, and we they just added. We're playing the uh, the exper. Ooh, two hundred wishies. We're playing the experimental version, and they finally gave us a way to abandon our ooblets into the wilderness. So, we've done a little bit of cleaning up of our party. So we've got we've got rid of our twelve lump stumps, and we're down to just the two. Tinstall, people won't stop haranguing me about the good townie commendations. They all think they deserve one. I think this initiative might have been a mistake. <laughs> Overwhelm in my realm. Uh, let's check out the fashions today. What is Night to Shine? I've never even heard of that. But it, I am very interested. I'm I'm always looking for more volunteer opportunities. I just I feel like it's one of those. Wait 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 wait. Hold on hold on. We're gonna come back to this into a second. Churls just. I don't know what to do with this. He'd just collect his own toenails. What do you need your toenails for, Churls? And why would you have to be rich for that? You can just collect your toenails in your house. I don't understand. It's, I mean, obviously it's the ownership of the darkened movie theater, I guess, that makes, that he needs to be wealthy for, but. Oh, that is so awesome. Uh, yeah, probably for the best, Churls. That is the weirdest thing I've ever heard you say. And you've said, I mean, you've said some enlightening things, but that is just, you don't need toenails. No one needs them. We shouldn't be collecting toenails. No one should. That's insane. He's gotta be. He's gotta have some devious use for those toenails. Maybe he's like scalping them down and turning them into his clothing or something. Oh, are we wearing Churls' toenails? I don't know if we can shop there now. Uh, but Milk Dud, that sounds really, really awesome. I, are they, are they like a national organization? I, I haven't heard of them around here at all. So I, I maybe it's just that I'm not in that realm or exposed to it, which is which is much more likely. Uh, we have so much we can do right now. What do we need to build some more sprinklers? I think we just need rain plops, right? Recipes. Sprinkler. Oh, no, we have the plops. We just need a cloth wet. Let's go build another sprinkler. Oh, Tim Tebow, of all people, really? That's super cool. I, I'm going to have to... I should... Uh, uh, Hunter, Buck, are you still in chat right now? Could you uh, drop the name of that charity in my suggestions? Actually, I yeah, because I don't have a pin next to me. Maybe. Oh, aha, I found one. Never mind, I got it. Okay, I'm going to write the name of this charity down so I can look into it later. You're up in... Sorry, I just saw you're up in Denver chilling with a cutie? Night to shine. Who's, who's this cutie in Denver? Alright, 
I, I'm going to look into them after this stream and, and see when and where there are opportunities in my area. Because if there are, I would love to volunteer for that. Ooh, Canamele. Couldn't have said it better, Taffy. Canamele indeed. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba. Uh, all right. We've got another sprinkler we can drop down. Nice. And <laughs> I I love that you're you're up in Denver chilling with someone and you've just got a stream going in the background. I I presume I I love and appreciate that so much and you are undoubtedly one of my favorite people. <laughs> All right. We're going to get a whole bunch more planted today. <laughs> we we do love that for you. Uh and we are exhausted. So let's take a little nap. <laughs> My biggest fan. All right. Let's see here. I think we also have a ton of oublet seeds we can plant, but we have to clear up our inventory a little bit before we can do that. Uh, and, oh my gosh, everything is growing now. I feel like this was a bad idea. We can't keep up with it. We're, we're farming too much. Oh, I just want to move back to the city. Uh, that is another oublet friend. Uh, Zenoka seeds. We can plant those. Till that. Boom. All right. Ooh, we got some we got some more seeds from weeding. That's not what we wanted, but it's a thing that has happened now. All right. We can plant one more there. We do have glasses we can stick on. Hmm. What do you think? I think Feebly needs some glasses. Take those. <laughs> yeah. That's cute. <laughs> Uh, and also, Wiggle Whip, we can strip you... Oh, our pockets are full. Let's see. Ugh, we need to sell. We can use the Stay Soggy and the Stay Extra Soggy. We don't really need those. We have enough sprinklers. But we'll just huck them on something. Alright. Now we're getting somewhere. We have the sprinkler we can drop. But we have to snap that brick... That Twig there first. Dun, dun, dun. But we need to rest. We might have to go visit the uh, nowhere again, too, so we can get some of those other oublets from there. We still haven't captured us a cactus one yet. All right, right here. We're going in. Snap that very carefully so we don't use too much energy. Place another sprinkler. There we go. Uh, and then we'll snap this. All right. We're getting close. We can plant some oublet seeds. Oh, we also have an oublet up here. Are we full right now? No, we're not. Oh, look at him. It's a goalie splot. <laughs> He's playing the air guitar. He's just strumming. Get it, goalie splot. All right. That's an unusual seed. Let's keep these together so we know that we're planting variants. So we'll put our variants over here. Uh, this isn't isopod. We have an isopod. And this is a tanling. Let's make sure that we don't have any more of these in our box here. 
We don't want to needlessly grow multiples of the same. Uh, yes, that was an unusual isopod. So we can get rid of these two. Uh, and we have an unusual lump stump. We can plant one of those. And an unusual clicky claws. We'll plant one of those. Perfect. Oh, we didn't check for tamlins. Uh, we don't have any other tamlins. Okay, perfect. Also, interesting. If we have an uncommon seed in our box and then we pull it out, it gives us credit for the daily for collecting an uncommon seed. So I feel like there's probably some uh, justification in keeping us uh, an uncommon seed at all times, right? Maybe that's just me trying to game the system, but it does feel like that's a smart play. Uh, let's get a lump stump here planted. And this clicky claws. Boom. We'll go to bed in a second. Let's just get this Tamlin planted now. Now we have some folks growing. Uh, we should probably pick all these, but we'll do that in the morning. We're exhausted anyways. Alright. We've been slacking on our friendships, but who needs friends when we have oublets? We're going to do... I, I, I'm hesitant to pick all of these yet because we don't have any seeds to replace them with. And I'd rather just replace them as we go. We can go buy some, though, which isn't too bad. But let's get... Uh, we have six more clock let seeds still. So let's get all these planted real quick. And then we'll go from there. I think once we're there, we can probably go just buy out mead store at this point honestly we've got 810 gummies yeah we're we're rolling in the dough we're like we're like whole ass farmers now we're doing this professionally making profits and and turning margin marg margins i i don't know business is that business talk the dow's up real good today and we're up 6.275 Stonks. Alright. I don't see any other seeds in our inventory. So we should be good there. Let's go check and make sure we don't have any more in any of these. Drop off this coffee. Drop off... Oh, we have medium sprinklers, but we don't really care for those right now. We could lay them down and just get more ground covered, but I'm not too worried. I think we've got enough farming to deal with right now. We can't even keep up with it, honestly. I think need will buy just about everything from it. We don't want to sell... I guess we could go process. Do we have any muzz? Quib... I don't think we have any muzz yet. I think all our muzz is still growing. Oh, nope. We have a ton we can pick. Okay. All right. We'll pick all this muzz that we can. Oh, let's just do it. Let's just bite the bullet, right? Muzz. And then we'll go buy out all the muzz again and plant some more. Because we just cannot get enough muzz right now. And once all this processes, we can make our hop dops. I think we should. We could probably buy out the pompadons and lawful flowers as well, and have those growing. And then we'll pretty much be there on all of our missions, really. At that point, we'll be growing pretty much everything. All right, get out of the way, sticks. Oh, I guess that's one way. As we pull a pompadon. All right. Uh, let's stick... Oh, we still have an extra lump stump. 
We need to get rid of him. We also need to get rid of one of these Clompers. All right, we're going to put Feebly in here. And then we'll stick Dumb Bird instead of one of these Clompers. And go get rid of Clomper as well. Send a couple friends off into the wilderness. Let them live their lives peaceful and free. Uh, pull off these. Put them on this wiggle whip. We're going to have to re-level all of our variants. But that's okay. We're fine without them. Dun, dun, dun. All right. You can stay home. And... Dumbbird can stay home for now. And then we need our lump stump to come with us. And our other clomper. Just a little bit of management. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, and we should stick Dumbbird in here while we're at it. Uh, where are you at? Not that Dumbbird. Our, our witchy Dumbbird. Okay. Back at it. Ugh. Our farm is a disaster, though. We definitely have to do some management soon. Get mu get the muzz while we can as well. Ooh, and Pompadons are on sale. Got him. All right. Taffy, what do you have to say? Cozy loves Cozy. Does Cozy love Cozy? I've been on an enchantment kick lately. Want me to enchant your face? Yes? Why Why can't I get my face enchanted? What sort of enchantment would she put on it? You've got another oublet you'd like to keep in the wildlands. This lump stump. I wonder if she has any potions that have been brewing. Once we do this, let's go check out our potions. Uh, no more ooblets to drop off. All right. I am in theater. I, I do production and entertainment primarily. Which is the, the crossover of why I have so much equipment that I'm using for streaming as well. <laughs> I mostly do technical theater, but I also act and direct and dabble in producing on the side. <laughs> I try to keep a very diverse resume. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Uh, let's see here. We can plant this muzz while we while we're here. <laughs> you know, it, it, it does kind of, doesn't it? <laughs> Which is why I've been trying to get into it for so long. It's just really hard to, to find the dedicated time slots. One of, one of the biggest struggles, and because our industry is shut down, it's given me time, is that we do a lot of work at, like, really odd hours, so... A lot of it is, like, just being available from 9 o'clock at night or, or 7 o'clock at night to 1 in the morning. <laughs> All right. This more energy is definitely helping. I haven't even noticed our energy dropping yet.
But it is nice having the sort of skills that translate. <laughs> I think, uh, how much Pompadant and Loppy Flowers do we have currently? We have 19, we need 40, 30, and 50 Sparkle Flowers. Please make a description. <laughs> I love this. There are still things in the game that they haven't finished. <laughs> Like the sparkle flower clearly does not have a description yet. <laughs> Which is absolutely beautiful. And I can't wait to see what they come up with for it. Alright. Uh, we need, what, two more ooblets to follow us now? Yeah. Let's grab... Let's grab this goalie splot. He's kind of cute. And then our dumb bird again. There you are, Dumbbird. Come, join the join the follow babies, Dumbbird. And Gully Splot is hidden somewhere around here. Where are you at? Um Oh, we have some muzz too. Let's grab this while we can. Make some more hot dops. Ugh, this farm is a mess don't know why I'm allowed to keep it. It's never going to get clean. Dun, dun, dun. We do have another baby here, though. Oh, it's our red lump stump. Yes. All right. We're going to swap out our regular lump stump for him now. Because grumpy lump stump is way cuter. They're definitely still going to be a cop, though. The only cop we can trust. Boom. You can stay home. All right. Now we need to find... Where is this other one at? Dumbbird's chilling over there. I'm not sure. Am I just missing them? Where'd you go? I know you have to be around here somewhere. <laughs> you know, I I think I'd be okay with getting arrested for that crime. <laughs> It'd be impossible to be as adorable as him. And it feels like the only the only real laws we should be abided to is how adorable we are, right? Where are you? There you are. We found you, Gully Sprout. Come with us. Join the follow babies. Alright, we're almost out of energy, so we're going to try not to screw with the farm too much now. We need to go do stuff. We can unlock more ooblets. Ah, this is tricky. I don't think we want to start getting expansions yet. I don't think we really have a reason for that. Hmm. We do have a ton of money still. So we will for sure buy... These lapa flowers, because we're going to need those. And then... I think we're just missing clothlets for our sprinklers right now. We could use our wishies on a bunch of clothlet. What would we need? Ten of them? And clothlets want... Yeah, let's do it. That'll get us five more sprinklers, which is almost double what we can grow right now. Uh, we can also look at what we need for our crops, or our, our coops here. Yeah, we could also build one or two of those instead. I think we spend almost all our wishies on clothlet right now, though, because we don't want to wait two days. <laughs> who, 
Who wants to do that when we can have instant gratification now? We do, however, want to get... Uh, did we already buy them? I think we already bought them. Car roots, sweet beets. Yeah, we've already bought everything we need right now. All right. Let's go grow a couple more sprinklers. And, yeah, we can't deposit any of these yet. But in a couple more days, we should be good to go there. Oh, we still can't fight the radishes. What do we need? Hop drops. We're getting close, though. Ooh, should we buy another chest? Have you ever wondered what's the smartest type of oublet? It's probably not Gree Buns. I like chatting with you. I like chatting with you, too. We got another monocle, which is the pinnacle of fashion. All right, we bought another chest. We didn't even hesitate. We just did it. Sprinkler, oob coop. And then sprinkler? Will we have enough? Yeah, perfect. All right. Our farm is slowly becoming the production paradise that we need. And thankfully, we have some more storage now, too. Ah, uh, we'll talk to the mayor while we're here. And Rugnolia. I can't walk five feet without someone demanding or begging for a good townie commendation. Yes? Hmm. Uh, what are our other missions? Plant sweet beaties and catch things. Oh, we can go catch things with sea danglers right now. We have plenty of those. I've been trying to come up with a null hypothesis to my assertion that I am genius. <laughs> Rugnolia... I think you just are a genius. There, You cannot come up with a hypothesis that disproves it, because you are. You're certainly smarter than I am. I don't even know, remember what a hypothesis is, if I'm being honest. That's just like a guess at science stuff, right? Alright. Let's catch some more trash today. Or clog our inventory up with more stay soggies. There's there's this interesting implication. We have basic bait, and it's called basic bait. And every time we we catch something, it gives us the option to change our bait. So I feel like at some point they're going to add other variants of bait, and I'm assuming it's going to affect what we can get. It just isn't out yet. All right. We'll chuck some more stuff in this guy as we come past him. Boom. We have so much we could sell to Mead. We might we might take a trip back to Mead and sell some stuff here in a minute. But until then, we have not done our dance battle today yet. Uh, we don't. Cute starts on the inside. You have to believe you're cute if you want to actually be cute. There's no such thing as just externally being perceived as cute without it, no internal reflection of it. It's true. We're only as cute as we see ourselves. Everyone is just projecting on each other anyway. So if you project the idea that you're cute, then other people will believe it. Uh, both teams can only play signature moves. All right, we're not going to make the same... And we don't have enough energy, apparently. But we're not going to make the same mistake we did in the past and pick a very bad energy-based uh, competitor here. We're going to pick someone with really good signature moves. Is there a way to become an expert without spending any time or energy on it? Milu, if I knew, I would be an expert at a lot of things right now. The amount of things I have tried to start to become an expert on and then just given up is astronomical. I I own too many things that are just like failed monuments of not being an instant expert. Dun, dun, dun. All right, we're going to go do our dance battle and then come back and, oh my God, pick all these sweet meaties, I guess. 
because apparently we're just doing really good at farming. You know, I think that might be part of the appeal of video games is that like they do let us just be an expert at something without any sort of effort or, or regard to it. In this game, I'm an expert farmer, and I don't know the first thing about farming. I couldn't tell you the difference between two kinds of dirt or fertilizer. All right. Uh, it's got, oh, our lump stump's not leveled anymore. That'd be a bad one to bring in. Hmm. I think... I think it's still a play. Yeah. <laughs> we'll just use this one move and generate a lot of hype. Two points every time a move is played this hand. And that's all they got, apparently. Oh, as I just pass my turn. I get I get in the rhythm of pressing E. And it just lets me throw away the game. <laughs> Do not resist arrest. This is this is how cops jam though. This is it. Could you imagine if 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 all of our police officers solved their disputes this way? Just with a nice wholesome dance off. It really would revolutionize it. Don't defund the police. Pay for them to go to dance school. All right. We've gotten our wishies. We've won the first battle. Battle 2 is coming up. We're going to bring him back in. Ah, oh, gloppy long legs. Long legs, look at him. Oh, we want one so bad. We do have a seed for it, I believe. We just haven't planted it. I need to remember to plant that seed. Uh, should we bring... Yeah, let's bring you in. Let's see what you got. Okay. It's not great, but <laughs> it's a combo. We'll earn two points for every single move we use. And then just use a move that gives us three points. Oh, they're on that same level. They're on the same plan. Earn three points and gain one beat. Yeah, we got them. We got this. Because we're gaining hype every turn, so we're going to be gaining an extra one for each of it. They're going to fall behind right now. And they missequenced. For shame. I, I feel like the AI shouldn't be able to missequence that play. It's, it's such an easy mess or oversight. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Make this a challenge. I think we win though on this one right eight plus six yeah that does it dun, 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 dun. eventually these folks will get back up there what was our our matchup last time we did this uh one of our folks stunned them every turn. Clomper. We need to put Clomper back on our team. Because without him, we're just... We are just throwing this away. And then... Uh, you're level 9. Let's bring you in. Just so we have a lot of abilities to piggyback off of. So we can use this and then just run out our hand. Uh, increase opponent's beat count by one. I think that's the play. Oh, we can't do that and that, though. But we'll go for that. We'll try to price him out of the game. Okay. Use ten points and gain three beats. Okay. This is rough. This is a very rough grouping here um do we have a means of earning points we have to right oh but our lump stump is stunned 
Okay, well, we're just going to price them out of the game and then keep our four points, right? <laughs> That'll win us the game. That's all we need. Add one. Okay, they're going to they're gonna get a couple points. Boom. I don't know if this fluster is going to drop us down to earning zero every turn now. I don't think so. I think we're still going to get our two, right? Yeah. The fluster only affects the immediate values on the card. So I think we got this. I don't think they're coming back from this. I think one more and they're out of... They're, they shouldn't be able to play anything. Yep. All right, all right. Boom. They've been locked out of the game. It's a little unfair, but... We ain't here to play fair. We're here to win. Use the next move twice. And gain some height. So I wonder if the two stacks for... Yeah, it does. Wow. We might, we might even be able to win this without going to time. Which is weird. It just it just took Lump Stump getting unstunned. There it is. What seed do we get? It seems the XP for winning a battle is the same no matter like what the battle is really. Ah, uh, what do you get, Gully Splot? You little cutie. Add one fluster and gain one hype. All right. Some sort of token. Plant me to grow a new friend. Bristlebud seed. Okay. Are Bristlebuds the little cactus folks we were wanting to go back to the island for? I think they are. Uh, I am using a uh, a Logitech C920 for my camera. Uh, it's it's like the basic Logitech. I think it's like a hundred bucks or so. And then for lighting, I have. Uh, let me let me let me take a picture here for you. It's I, I just have overhead lighting from just my regular house lights. It's probably not the best in the world, but it, it works, at least temporarily. And then for my front light, I have... Uh, I just got a new phone, so it's impossible to find the camera. Here we go. All right. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, for for my for my uh, lighting, I have I don't know if you can see it here. It's just a a single front light. It's they at Walmart you can get just little like housings. They're like aluminum housings for light. And then I stuck an LED in there and then got some cheap diffuser cloth. And just velcroed it on. It's a it's a really sort of ghetto way to build it myself, but it was a hell of a lot cheaper than paying for any sort of professional lighting. Uh, I, I I definitely recommend whatever you get, put a diffuser on it, because that'll help like reduce it so it's not as harsh. Uh, I might be able to show you. <laughs> That's the difference without the diffuser. So it causes a lot of, like, awful reflection and glare off my wonderfully uh, moist skin.
yeah, it, it helps a ton. So I, I would definitely recommend whatever you get, at least get some sort of uh, diffuser cloth of some sort to put over it. But really, I mean, the distance at which the light is, any, any pretty basic LED light will do you. I went with something with a little bit of uh, yellow in it rather than like straight white just because I, I like that sort of incandescent look. But even even if you went straight white, it would still look great. It depends on if you just like that sort of like cleaner modern look. And that's that's all I've got is just like one one down light from above and one front light. If if I really wanted, I could light myself from the background a little bit, which would probably help me stand out. But I, I haven't had too much uh, complaint about the background or anything yet, so. Uh, my pockets are tippy tip full. I did get, let's see here. We got another chest, yes. Let's go ahead and drop this on the other side of the bed. And now we can drop some herbs in here. Uh, raw foods? Yeah, let's just get all our raw food in here. So we can grow resources and raw food. That's interesting. There's no real set distinction, apparently. And then we have... Oh, there's our legsy seed. We need to plant that. Let's get our legsy planted real quick. Before we tune in for the night. Alright. And we could probably drop our coop. Oh, but that means we have to move that. And I'm not about that right now. Eh, I guess might as well. Oh, we have to remove the oublet. We can't just uproot our oublet from its home, apparently. Break this. And... Boom. Perfect. I don't think we have the mats to upgrade it right now, though. No, we do need an obsidian and four cloth let. But we can stick. Uh, who do we want? Why do we have another lump stump? Where do these lump stumps keep coming from? I thought we got rid of them. Huh. Oh no, that's our that's our good lump stump. That's the one we dropped off. That's right. We don't want to get rid of that one. <laughs> All right. We'll just break these and drop our... our... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> We've glitched the game. I don't know how we managed to do that, but we did it. Boom. Put our Fleeble back in there. And we got, we got a whole operation going on now. If you want, I can shoot you uh, a link to the diffuser cloth I bought from Amazon. It was fairly cheap. I don't think it was too bad. And then I just got some uh, hot glue and, and glued some Velcro onto it so I could take it on and off. Yeah, let me let me pull that up real quick.
should be somewhere. That's not the one. There it is. All right, I found it. I'm going to drop it in chat. And then you can just cut it to whatever size you need, and it's, it's more than enough. I did... I think I've done six lights with it now. And I still have a ton of extra. Uh, let's go do some more farm management. Uh, we don't have any rube blood for you, unfortunately. What we do have is a ton more to plant. I think we might just start growing uh, a ton of cloth let in some part of our farm here. Just because we need so much of that for everything. I don't think it would hurt to just be buying up all the cloth let every day. Alright, uh, we have Tamlin. We're waiting for Legsy for sure. Oh, that's another lump stump? Oh, we're going to have to let one go. For now, we're just going to farm up all this. Once we have, once we've cleared out our inventory of seeds, I think we'll just focus on clothlet from here on, at least for now. Yeah, let's go get some clothlet. I think we have the money to just, I uh, mean, I don't think we have enough to buy all 30, 20 of it. We can buy 10 of it. Oh, nope, that's Lapla Flower. Ah, we can buy 13. I think if we sell a little bit, we can get there. We have a ton of sweet beaties that we don't really need. Oh, she's not buying them right now. She's only buying muzz. Okay. Okay, Mead. I see how it is. Just just controlling the market entirely. Either that or we don't have them in our inventory. It's that we don't have them in our inventory. That seems more right. But you know what? We don't need it. We got enough. We've we're we're getting close to half our farm, I think, established. I think that's more than enough right now. I definitely don't think we're keeping up with it in any capacity. Oh, you know what we could do? We could just murder this poor lump stump, stump while he's still in his pod. Uh, 
it's it's a very sad and tragic thing to do but you know what can i say it just isn't practical oh nope it just pulled it anyways oof that's not what i wanted to do well you live on the farm for now, Lump Stump, but your time will come. Dun, 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 dun. All right. Oh, it's nap time. Let's take a quick nap. I think we've got enough slots to finish planting. We could buy some other seeds. Or, I mean, we're about to be rolling in some money. It's, it's taken us a while to get there, but once we have our, our pompadons, lopal flowers, and a couple more muzz. Actually, I think we have the muzz now. We just have to go process it. Yeah, we have 16. That's more than enough. Should have done that before we napped. But that's okay. We ain't min-maxing. We're just here for a good time. Uh, we don't have anything to put in there, do we? No. That's unfortunate. I want to make sure we save a spot for Legsy. So we're going to make sure that grows first. Dum, da, da, dum. Uh, we don't need... We don't have an unusual plop yet. We'll go plant that. Uh, an unusual clomper. Oh, I think we have enough hop dops now. We only need 40. Perfect. Grab those. I think we need seven more. Five, six, seven. Uh, that is 39. One more. Boom. All right, we're about to make one grand. This is going to be insane. This is the most money we're going to make in a single transaction. <laughs> Fifteen hundred, yes, please. Uh, should we work on oodles next? Why not? Gives us two grand. <laughs> now we can buy, buy the rest of that cloth plant and see what we need for oodles. All right, thanks for checking us out. I I really appreciate the support. All, uh, what time do you normally stream? I'll make sure to swing in by yours, too. Oodles, we need Button Boy. Borg oh, that was a bad get. Oof. Perfect. 4 p.m. to 6 p.m.? Hell yeah. I'll, I'll definitely check you out. I'll be by... I'll swing by tomorrow. Uh, and in case anyone was wondering... Sir Milk Dud Streams... Go check out their channel. Dun, 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 dun. But enjoy the rest of your night, and thank you so much for, for swinging by today. I, I really appreciate it, and I hope I helped you a little bit with, with lights and stuff. Uh, let's see go plant some more we're just we're just gonna keep on this planting train right now that's enough cloth let for another sprinkler And we are exhausted again. Let's pull this cloth plant and then go nap.
Boom. I'm not sure how we should be managing our, our storage here. It's feeling a little unorganized. Hmm. But I don't know what to do with it. I think disorganization is just the look we're going for right now. Refill all these slots. It's so hard to keep up with a big farm. But we gotta do it. It's the way it's the way we make that cheddar. Oof. I accidentally just overtilled. And we got a little sleepy from it. Let's pop Hermble Unusual Clomper. Let's get this clomper growing. We have a slot here. Clicky Claws, Isopod, Talman. Oh, God, we just want that legsy. That's what we're in it for. We're in it for those sweet, sweet legs. You know, there, there's something really nice about charming sound design like this game. It's all been very repetitive, but it's never felt repetitive. I, I haven't got that feeling yet. It, it does a very good job keeping a variety. So I'm always very impressed that, like, I, I haven't even recognized that the music has been replaying very much. Ooh, we got more seeds from the weeds. I think that's going to be about it for the day. We might be able to get one more planted, right? Five, eight, nine. Yep, perfect. Unless we can squeeze in one more nap, which we can. Oh, have we dance battled yet? I don't think we've dance battled for the day. Not that we really need seeds right now. <laughs> we we are not being able to keep up with the rate at which our Ooblet army is growing. Uh, also, well, we got to remember to drop off our lump stump because we don't need that other lump stump right now. They're just kind of taking up space. What do you want, Milu? Whenever I get back to the Ubnet, I'm going to unleash all the zingers I've been bottling up. Oh, is this a variant of Ugum? We don't have any of that. That's unfortunate. I think we should eventually just craft some of the materials for different fights, just in case we run into variants. I think it would definitely help. All right, let's go. Let's do this. Dogsy Dog. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. It's like half bear, half dog. And it just looks hype. Oh, okay. It's a normal dance battle. In that case, I think we're good with... Hmm. Clicky Claws? Let's bring Clicky Claws in. Let's see how they do. <laughs> All right. Uh, if we have two turns like this, we're going to scream through it. Oh, but they might just mirror us. All right. We have four points. We'll gain a hype and steal three. Oh, hype does apply to steals, too. That's good to know. I think that's the first time we've ever seen that. Add a fluster. Okay. We're just we're net neutral right now. All we need is seven points. Dun, dun, dun. 
Oh, man. They had, like, no costs on that. We have five points. Dang. So close to a win this turn. That's okay, though. Ain't no worries. I don't think they're pulling it off. Maybe. Oof. Oh, they might do it. Okay. Steal five points and win the game. That was dangerously close. Dun, dun. That was exhilarating. What seed are we getting for this? A plob seed. Do we have a, a plob growing? I feel like this is where we're going to be getting a lot of um, of the more rare and, and variants and stuff. Leg Z and side key. Well, we'll go side key, side key. Just hit up the mirror. And then... We got to level our lump stump back up. They're just too good. Uh, that's two, four. I guess we'll do it. We need the hype. Dun, dun, dun. Bum, 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 dun. All right. End our turn. Earn 10 points after two turns of warm-up. That's rough. I don't think we have a stun. But we can earn 16 points this turn. I think that's the play, right? That's literally what they're going to earn after two turns. So, And it puts us like two points away. Four points. I think that's the play. Bum, bum, bum. Boom. I should check. The, the patch notes didn't mention in addition to the new zone. So I doubt it's added. But I should go check the hot air balloon just in case. We haven't looked at that yet. All we know is we can abandon our oobs. But I do figure a new zone would probably have been talked about, right? One more. Oh, it's a Wiggle Whip we get. Do we even want a Wiggle Whip? Ah, we'll do it for the XP. Alright. Alright. Because we have Wiggle Whips. We got plenty of Wiggle Whips. Uh, let's get Dumbbird in there. Get a little level up on them. I think this lets us run out this whole hand. Bum, bum, bum. All right, all right. Just gonna add fluster to us like that, Fleeby. All right, fine. We don't care. We don't care. We're not flustered at all. We're not flustered, not even a little bit. You can't get in our head. You think you can? No. We're good. We're good. We're not panicking. We got this. It's in the bag. It's an easy one. We only need 10 more points. You need 26. Okay, we only need 13 more points. All right. All right. What if we just, uh, hmm. So we need, we need 13 points. That's, uh, five, six, seven. We'll get there. Yeah. We're going for the win. We don't need to slow them down. We're not afraid. They ain't hyped. We're hyped. It is a petty formation. 
I always forget Fleeb has that reduced cost one. They, we should really be bringing them in more. But it's not like we need it, baby. We out here winning. Dumb bird, did you get it? Yeah, take your level up. Oh, bird has trepidation. That's right. We don't even really care about that. I feel like that'd be way better if we had PvP. Which I would really be interested in if they add that as a feature. Alright. Let's check it out. Let's see what they got. See if our balloon will take us down to paradise. Ooh, we do have a clothlet. We also have not been checking for obsidian on the ground at all. Which is probably a bad move. Have you ever, like, seen an ooblet fly? I feel like we should see more ooblets fly. No, nowhere is still not open. Uh, we did almost glitch, though. Again. We've gotten really good at that. Just finding the little nooks and crannies we can just slide right in on and, like, creep and, like, fall into. bum ba dum ba dum ba All right. No obsidian. I don't see any. Be nice to have uh, one of those rainbow storms, because it always seems like obsidian spawns during that. I would wonder if it also increases the chance of finding a gleamy. Oh, is our legsy done? Yes! Oh, <gasps> Legsy's the fish? Legsy's the fish! Oh my god! Legsy's the fish! I thought it was going to be the long leg dupe. Oh, fuck. We got the fish. Oh, I'm so excited. Who are we kicking off our team right now for Legsy? Oh, God. Uh, who, don't, who don't we want? We never play with Peter Porker, even though he's cute. Wiggle Whip, Wiggle Whip, you're going home. Give me your accessories and leave. Leave. Uh, inventory's full. Too much is happening. Fuck it. You can keep them. You can keep the accessories. We're not putting them on anyone else, Wiggle Whip. Oh, my God. Here, 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 here. Take your, take your stupid hat and leave my party. Legsy, where are you? Legsy, where'd you go? Come to me. I need you. I know you're here. Oh, let's grab this muzz while we're doing it. Uh, not that we need it anymore. We finished our hop dops. Uh, but we do need it for a bunch of other stuff we're baking. Uh, where are you? Where Legsy. Legsy, come back to me. My sweet prince, follow me. All right. We have it. We have Legsy. Let's see who Glanter is. Nope, there's no more space. See, this is why we waited. And boy, howdy, was it worth that wait. Uh, we'll plant this Hermbal, whatever the heck a Hermbal is. Oh, we know what a Hermbal is. It's that nasty little Danny or, or uh, uh, Chevy Chase looking uh, weatherman dude. Uh, we do, however, have to get rid of an Ooblet. Uh, you can go home for now so we can find our other lump stump. Oh, guys, this tonight has just been incredible. We got a legsy. I'm so excited. It, I feel like I just found a legendary Pokemon. Like, I, I can't look at it. Look at this dumb fish. Oh, it's perfect. Everything about it is perfect. All right. Leave us second lump stump. Go to the wilderness. Be free. Uh, 
eventually it seems like we're going to have access to the wildlands too. I don't know what's going to be out there other than all the feral oobletts we've let go now. It, it would be nice to see them once again in the distant future. Scavenging, foraging for food, left abandoned, rotten to die. All right. Let's grab this glanter. Oh, yes, it's this Oogie Boogie motherfucker. Yes, you're coming with us. Holy crap, the Ooblets have been great today. Oh, let's plant this bristle bud. Oh, I'm so fucking excited. We're going to have to redo our whole team soon. All right, let's get to bed before we're drowsy. Uh, yeah, we'll sleep until the morning. Da -da -da. All right. I wish, I know, there is no lying in bed for like six hours with the insomnia, like unable to fall asleep. There's no, I mean, as far as I'm aware, there's no sleep paralysis, but the oobletts looming over you every night might just be that. Like, is that what sleep paralysis is? Is it just oobletts? But yes, it would be incredible if it was as easy as just like, Put your head on, pillow. Now you wake up. But no, everything in life has to be way harder. And we've almost set up our farm fully here. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying, it very well could be. Ooblets could just be sleep paralysis demons that have gained sentience in this world. I, a lot of them do resemble my demons, so I, ca causation isn't correlation or one of those two, but like, prove, you, I don't think you can prove to me that ooblets aren't, uh, do we have more seeds? I don't see any, oh, we have one sweet beauty, perfect. And we have more than enough gummies to go buy out the cloth lead again. And also more wishies. Alright, what do we got? Do we go with faster run speed? Or do we save up, maybe? I, I'm i just saying, I have. I've seen both demons and ooblets in the same room. And it was while I was under sleep paralysis. Uh, let's get even more ooblets. Uh, do we get even more ooblets? How many... How many of these can we get? How many are there? How many unlocks of more ooblets? Did we just finish it? I think we did. I think we got all the ooblets unlocked. Okay. Uh, all right. Well, let's just work our way down then. Plinies. More home decor. Grindies. Boom. All right. We're getting there. Unlock. Spot even more ooblets in Badge Town. Yeah. A ton of more ooblets in Badge Town. Okay. We need more seeds. Let's go get Clothlet. I'm just imagining now, like, trying to fall asleep, and there's going to be hundreds of ooblets just crawling on me one night. I was running around looking where I put my new reet root. Turns out I'd planted them all. Well, that's a good story. That had a beginning, a middle, an end, a climax, rising action, character arc. That was everything we needed. Dun, dun, dun. Give me your cloth plants. Your expensive, expensive cloth plants. Uh, is nothing on sale today? Oh, the dribbler's on sale. Well, yeah, let's buy that while it's on sale. Not that we ever water our plants anymore. <laughs> what is this archaic idea? 
Uh, we do have another sprinkler we can drop still, too. Which is perfect. Because we have another 20 cloth plant. Each one of these does 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 24 total? Wow. Uh, we did just accidentally till that. Rip. We might have to buy... We, we need to see what we need for these quib tarts and stuff, because we're going to have to build them eventually. And I think we might want to start growing whatever gives us those. Or we go to the other... Our little... Uh, uh, clubs and see if we can get seeds from them again that might be the play grow their unique stuff also we're just gonna back to back nap it up right now we need the energy the nice part is once we've done this maintenance on our farm we won't have to do it again as long as we keep up with it so these long days of farming will be over Ugh, as all our muzz is grown now. All right. All right, muzz. Fine. The muzz becomes cloth plant. And I think we're either close to, if not at, the pompadons and lawful flowers by now. Uh, we have flutie flowers. Let's go see. I think all of it's in our boxes in here. We need 30 of each. So there's our lopple flowers. We only have 19 still. Sweet beaties. Pompadons. We only have 18. So those are just taking forever to grow. All right. I see how it is. Either that or we haven't grown anymore. Could be both. We might go just buy Muzz out, honestly. Since we do need so many seeds right now, Jesus. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> Look at this farm. <laughs> Look at it. We're almost there. We've almost created it. These are all done growing. Which means we can get another sprinkler i believe let's check it out what do we need yep we can get another sprinkler or yeah we don't have the wishies for an obsidian so yeah we can get another sprinkler wicked which one two one two three four five and then we have this one last row in between the two hmm Dun, 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 dun. Let's go build a sprinkler and go check out the town for some seeds. Uh, let's check in with Churls, see if he has anything fun to say today. Maybe he'll enlighten us about how sleep paralysis demons are just ooblets. If anyone in this town knows, Charles Twisted Ass knows for sure. Since I lost access to the Oobnet, I haven't been able to look up to... Oh, okay. Charles, you shouldn't be doing that anyways. You're just going to find out that you have 17 different forms of cancer. Also, that's a fun sweatshirt, and we're going to buy it. We almost missed it. We almost missed you, sweater. But we caught you. Let's, let's swap up the fashions. I think we're going to go back to the... To the leggings and the striped sweater and the witch hat yeah that's a look i like it that's a look all right sprinkler seeds and then just keep working on our farm just keep keep on the grind we're living that farm life we also could be adding wooden paths to make, like, formal walkways. Wait. 
These wooden tiles to block weed growth. What? What? They block weed growth? Oh, is it just like in that general area? I think that's just in that general area. I'm assuming it doesn't mean in tiles next to it. If it did, that'd be buck wild. Do you have seeds, my gentlemen? You do have the squirt gun. Yes, give me it. Do we have the do we have the mats? Yes, we're buying that and we're giving it. We're giving it to Legsy. Take the squirt gun, Legsy. Take the squirt gun. Look at him. He's a fish with a squirt gun. That's so cute. That is that is so cute. Okay, uh Let's see. Machine shop drop bop. I think we're going to go with the machine shop drop bop, right? Oh, we can't afford that. Can we get 9? Can we get 8? Can we get 7? 6. 5 for sure. 4 surely. There 4. We can get 4. We're growing some Znakas right now, so. I guess while we swing around, we can do the dance battle up here. <laughs> this fish will undoubtedly rule the world. Uh, let's go with the candy floss. Candy floss first. And then see if we can't get some puffed disrupt. This is a fish that will not be stopped, no matter what we do. I I thought, man, do we give it the monocle too? Do we, do we want to turn it into an evil genius villain? Like, I don't know. I think if we give it a monocle, we're setting a precedent that like it has to live up to, right? I don't know if that's a safe... Uh, we're bringing the fish in. I don't even care how good it is. We're bringing the fish in. This is our this is our number one now. Uh, oh, shit! Those are cards? Oh, I just bought a whole bunch of cards. I thought they were seeds, but they're cards. Of course they're... Of course. Of course they're cards. Why would they have a candy floss fuss... None of these do me any good now. I have a handful of one-time use cards. Oh, this was bad. All right, we're going to gain hype, I guess. All right. Well, <laughs> we have so many cards. We're going to get so many dead draws now. Can I leave these at my house? All your beats cost one less. I just... Oh, that was such a bad play. Yeah, guess what? We're going to draw so many of these. <laughs> They're fucking cards. They're not seeds. Oh, Jesus. That's a really cool mechanic, though, that you can buy cards. It, it makes me really interested in the future of... <laughs> it makes me really interested in the future of the potential of deck building. Not like this, though. Not like this. This is not how I would actually build a deck. This is a very bad deck. This is just littered with garbage buffs that don't do me any good. Alright, well, that was a rough one. That's a, that's a way to do the dance competition. I really hope I can take these out of my inventory. I, ugh. Yeah, I guess. I guess I did my best. That wasn't even... Nope. Nope. I can't. Oh, God. Oh, God. I can't. Oh, I just have to run them out. Fuck. That's rough. Oh, it 100% was. I I would buy all of these as plushes if I could. If they announced tomorrow that they were selling Ooblet plushes, I would buy all of them. 
like not even hesitate. I don't even care. Like these things are so much cuter than Pokemon. And the mechanics and the gameplay is so much better, so it actually, like, makes me not ashamed to say that I play the game. Which is, like, revolutionary. Alright, let's get some actual seeds, I guess. Jesus. <sighs> what do we need? What are we working on? Uh, quib tarts, flutie, karaoke's, carrot cakes, and clambrosas. Uh, quib tarts, we need fructose and quib. Floaty karaoke's, we need floaty flowers, which we have a ton of already. Uh, what else did we need? Clambrosas, we need sweet beets, sorbet. Ah, oh, we've got to start picking things up. Is what we got to start doing, I think. All right, uh, let's just get. We'll just get whatever's on sale every day. Yes! See, that'd be so much better! I would 100% play the fuck out of that. Like, that's... My problem with Pokemon Go is that, like, the gameplay and mechanics just aren't worth it. And... But an Oobleck game would 100% be worth it. And you could, like... You could have an AR, like, capturing mechanic where you find the Ooblets and you battle them, but then you can also have, like, a trading card game mechanic where you can pass other traders and trade your cards with them and stuff. It would be so good. All right, we need Zenokas for a bunch right now. We'll get those. And then, yeah, you could just have them, like, hang out while you do stuff. And the fights would be dance parties. Oh, it'd be so good. And it's probably never going to exist. I feel like someone needs to pitch this to the devs. I think it's just a small team of like two. Which is wild to me that like such a small group is making such a great game. But then again, a lot of really good games have come from, like, very small one- or two-person devs. Alright, let's just gather here around town. We need the yellow shells. There's one. We need yellow shells and just about all the mushrooms we can get of every type. And it doesn't seem there's a way to grow mushrooms ourselves yet or anything, so that's unfortunate. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, everything about an AR Pokemon Go style Ooblets game just sounds primo. We did pick one of these, right? Yeah, let's plant that there. The question is, could it compete in a Pokemon Go right market right now? Would it would it be worth exploring? Or is the market already too just like dominated by that one game? Because as far as I'm aware, too, Pokemon Go is really the only sort of AR game that's caught on. Because others have tried. Oh, definitely not in spooky climate. For sure not in spooky climate. It would have to be designed for spooky climate if you were going to release it now. But once spooky climate has resided... Or pre-spooky climate, would it have been possible? I, I don't know what that would look like, honestly. Because, like, part of the charm is getting you out in the world, right? So, how would you do a home-based AR game? Unless you, like... 
I mean, there'd have to be some sort of, like, multiplayer aspect still. Otherwise, unless it was, like, a very, very chill, like, relaxing game. You know, <laughs> you could even do AR farming. I wonder if that could work. Like, have the same sort of farming mechanic as in Ooblets, but, like, make it AR. And so, like, you go outside and you actually, like, square off parts of your land and grow there. You could focus solely on that sort of aspect of the game to begin with and get that kind of perfected and then move into the, all right, now we're focusing on, now that, now that spooky climate's gone, we have uh, a climate for, uh, we're completely broke. Hmm. Uh, we can sell crumb berries. We don't need crumb berries. We don't need yellow she or white shells. Um, we can sell like six of these. Seven? Seven sounds good. That gives us the mats we can use to buy this cloth plant seed. Three of it, apparently. Exactly! <laughs> oh, yeah, it'd be perfect for apartment people! So many people wanted to grow plants, but they can't. Ooh, we spotted a new bled. Uh, that would give them the freedom to, like, have the plants and still grow them and, and, and feel that sort of, like, doing it. But without having to, like, actually have plants in an apartment. You know? Ugh, I want this so bad now and it's never gonna happen. I, I'm going to eat. Oh, is that an obsidian? Yes! No, we don't want to go in there. Oh, God. We're going to lose so many of these battles. Oh, I forgot about our cards. And it feels bad just to waste them because they were so expensive and we wasted all of our tokens on them. But we literally have 30 of these bad cards we have to go through. All right, all moves cost zero beats. What a fucking turn you went to go through all of them on. Get back in here, legsy. Ugh, all right. Bye. We're just gonna spam all of these. Eventually, we'll run out of them. Or they'll just destroy us before we get the chance to run out of them. Oof. Yep. Yep. <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> oh, God. We're going to lose at least four days of dance battles because of this. Oof. Yep. There it is. Another one down. Dun, 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 dun. There's always tomorrow's tournament. Try again. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we're going to we're going to be doing all of these tournaments every day and losing them. All right. What's under here? A recipe. Some clothlet. Some more mushrooms. Oh, what you want, cop? The last mayor used to refuse all my requests, so all in all, I suppose Tinstall is doing a decent job seems about right. Even in Ooblets, you can't avoid partisanship. I don't think we can dance with anything right now. Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. We do need tons of quip right now. We just need a lot of everything. God, I can't wait to get it a crown. 
Did we ever settle on giving it a monocle and turning it into an evil genius? Or are we avoiding that sort of narrative arc that we know we would be creating and ultimately leading to us having to destroy our own child? Bum, ba, da, da, da. Do we have any seeds? No. We have a few cloth plant. That's it. All right. Yeah, and then you could like, oh, you could even set up like a system of trade and sale like in the real world too. So you could, if you needed like meat, mead or muzz or like floaty plant or whatever, you could trade with your neighbor. And you could have the little ooblets running around doing the trading. Oh God. You could have your lump stump just carrying like muzz over to your neighbor and drop it off and then trade them. Oh, it'd be so cute. It'd be so cute. All right, we're going to get rid of this muzz, and then we're going to buy some more muzz. How much muzz can we get? Can we get 20? Yeah, we can. And then we'll get some sweet beauties. As many as we can get. All right. That should be enough to keep everything planted for now. And then we might just have to do some sales in a bit. Oh, we we got to be close to our pompadons and loppy flowers, though. They're growing. Slowly but surely, they're growing. As long as... I mean, I'm, I'm trying to keep our our farm at full capacity of growth right now, which is really tricky. Just because we, oh, we have so much. Let's see. Where is our muzz? There's our muzz seeds. And we're just getting more. I forgot we have another uh, sprinkler to put down, and we still haven't finished this sprinkler. But we're almost there. The hardest part is the energy it takes every day. And it doesn't help that we keep over tilling. Boom. I think this might fill out. Yeah, we're still going to have a little bit extra here. Close, though. We're very close. But we don't have the gummy. Uh, we're going to buy some gummy just because we might as well right now so we can finish our farm. I wonder how many ooblets there are total in the game. I think we know this, actually. We can go look at the ooblet sheet and see. Because that'll tell us what we need in, form, in, in terms of coops. Because if each coop gives us an extra four. Almanac. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. 40 times 3. Uh... Is 120? So there's 120 total ooblets. If we're counting every variant of every ooblet. Which obviously we are. We're not just going to collect the plain ones. Dum, 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 dum. Sweet beaties. And then... What else do we want? Carrots, pompadon, spring beans. We haven't grown spring beans in a hot minute. 
Let's get as many spring beans as. Oh, we're full again. What can we sell? What don't we want? Ugh, I guess we just get rid of this one, Muzz. <laughs> Alright. Let's go plant all these. I think once we get to a point of like being caught up, it's going to be a lot easier to move forward, I think. Plant that there. That there. We do have some down here that we can already plant, so let's just knock these out. Ugh. Plant that. Oublet, let me plant. You're not even doing anything there, really. I guess they might be watering it. <laughs> I like that they're watering empty spaces. You don't even know. You don't even know if I'm gonna put anything there, Oublet. That's a that's a gross assumption. So if each one gives us four, and there's a hundred and twenty total that we need. And that means uh, we can hold a base of six or something. That means we need a lot of coops if we want to collect them all. All right. I guess 30, right? 30 coops total. Presuming there's no further upgrades. All right. We have one more, but not enough energy. But we can still nap. We got this. We got this. Oh, we can plant it. Boom. I can't weed that, though. We could always just manually water that, or just take a nap and drop our sprinkler like an adult. Dun, 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 dun. Bum, bum. <laughs> Oh, it's a shame we got Lagsy and haven't been able to use them in battle yet. Alright. Oh, let's do some weeding while we can. This is interesting, because now we have no gummies, we have no seeds, but we have things we can pick. Let's leave them for now. We've already gotten pretty much everything we can from the town today. Or everything we care about. Let's go see if we can't craft these couple of things we need right now. Quib tarts, fluties, carrot cakes. Just come in here. Carrots. Uh, let's see. Clambrosa. We can do one of those. How many of those do we need? Three total. Okay. One, two. Perfect. We have exactly enough. Three. We need two carrot cakes. What are we missing? Mud flower and muzz and fruit tooth. So we need sweet beeties and muzz. Oh, we already have our muzz flower. We just don't have fruit juice. Let's go make some fruit juice. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Soon we might have to make a second one of these. Oh, this isn't upgraded yet, but I think we have the mats now. They can't water, can they? Yeah, now they can. Lumstump, have a friend. 
uh, this wiggle whip. Now water the plants for me. No, not Muzz. We want sweet beauties right now. Uh, let's just do 20. Keep some on hand. We are never going to make 40 oodles. That's just going to take forever. I, I think we should just abandon that if we can. There are much more efficient ways to make money. Uh, where is it at here? Cancel. Yes. Um, Spressies aren't hard to make, are they? I don't think Spressies are hard to make. Let's check. Spressies just need ground spring beans and fruit toast. And Puggle Pie's even easier. Was Puggle Pie an option there? Yeah. Oh, wow. Let's make those. That's a joke. All right. All right. All right. This is not worth it. We're going to cancel that order. Uh, let's just do these nernies. We have them. Boom. We have these sweet beaties. Let's do those. Boom. Uh, we have the muzz, I think, don't we? It's just not worth it. We need muzz for other stuff right now. But this gives us enough money to get the last few seeds we probably need. Uh, we could do cloth plant. But I think we want pompadon. Do we want pompadons and fluties? Little flowers. I don't think we're growing any more of these right now. Uh, hmm. I think we are. They just take forever. Uh, we'll we'll just go with the cloth plant for now. It's we got eleven. That's more than enough. And then we can go drop off these and I believe we need, some, there's something else we can drop off. We'll figure out what it was here in a second. Or we'll just do it in the morning because we're going to be out of energy. have three energy that's not enough to do anything with all right we nap we're gonna take a little nap and then hop back in tomorrow we're almost level nine i don't know if we're gonna unlock anything but once we get there we'll see I think we have a little room we could grow a couple more oublets too, but we don't have oublet room right now, which is unfortunate. Mayor Tinsel wants a sweet beauty. I think we can oblige Mayor Tinsel. We have the means to do that. And by that I mean we own sweet beauties. 